Could I ask you some more questions? Of course. I also find our dialogue. What can you tell me about voodoo? Historical voodoo? Or the voodoo currently practiced? What can you tell me about voodoo? Historical voodoo? Or the voodoo currently practiced in the city? Tell me about current voodoo. Many people think of voodoo in terms of magic spells or grigri. That kind of practice is actually called hoodoo and is only a part of true voodoo. Voodoo, the religion, has a strong following in New Orleans. In fact, it, there are several voodoo churches or temples in the city and others all across the United States. African Americans see it as a tradition all their own. Whites and there are many in their religion, are attracted to it because they think I, personally, am more interested in the history of voodoo. Some of the new movements are copying Haitian or even African voodoo, but it is the voodoo of New Orleans that I find so. Tell me more. There are many voodooans in New Orleans. They often do business selling grigri, telling fortunes, providing luck, and occasion. Perhaps you would like to meet a voodooan. We refer those who seek a deeper experience with voodoo to a local practitioner. Sure, I'd love to meet her. She lives on the corner of Orleans and Dauphine. I will call her and tell her you might stop by. Great. Tell me about historical voodoo. Very well. I will start at the beginning, Mr. Knight and will go on from there at your prompting. Sounds good. As you may know, voodoo is a grassroots religion formed by the mixing together of many different African tribal religions. And in other words, it is a religion born of the African slave trade. But African slaves were imported prior to 1803. The New Orleans area was owned by France, but the Creole did not permit their slaves to gather giving no chance for voodoo to breed. The Creole also knew enough about the corrupted pagan practices of the West Indies slaves to ban the importing of slaves. So, how did voodoo come to New After the Louisiana Purchase, American legislators relaxed regulations. Slaves were permitted to gather. The Americans also removed the ban on... Around the same time, a slave revolt occurred in Santo Domingo, what is now Haiti. Between the lifting of the ban and the Haitian revolt, West Indies... Some of them were free people of color, freed or escaped slaves. Some came with their white owners who... What happened when the West Indies... They brought voodoo with them. The native slaves were more than enthusiastic about embracing it. It gave them... Among the first meeting places were the Bayou St. John. The early voodoos were heavy snake worshippers, worshipping the... Tell me more about... By 1817, the voodoo activities were beginning to cause fear among the white slave owners. An ordinance was... The time was Sunday afternoons and the place, Congo Square. The slaves and free people of color gathered to dance simulations of their voodoo dances. Of course, they... Tell me more about historical voodoo. There were a variety of kings and queens at first, voodoo priests and priestesses. But from about 1830, a single power... This was a voodoo queen named... Marie Laveau. Tell me more about... I've given... Do you know... Many have read about... That's... Tell me more about Marie Laveau. There were actually two Marie Laveaux, mother and daughter. Most people thought they were the same woman. Her continued youth added to the original. The mother was also known as Widow Paris. When the Widow Paris began to practice, there were many voodoo ends in
Tell me more about Marie Laveau. The widow Paris was a hairdresser for rich Creole ladies. She also paid household servants to spy for her. Between the two, she, she was not above using her information to appear psychic, to intimidate. You sound as... For a black woman in the mid-1800s to gain power is an incredible... Tell me more about Marie Laveau. She kept a pet snake, danced with it too. She held traditional voodoo ceremonies. She took herself seriously. Very seriously. But she was not above selling tickets for her events too. She was not above using voodoo any way she could to make money. That is for certain. But if she had been in another line of work, in another age, that would have been interpreted as entrepreneur. Hey, you don't need to convince me. I'd tell me. It was Marie Laveau who defined the voodoo that is truly and unique. She invented hundreds, if not thousands, of spells, potions, charms, and incantations. These form the basis of the modern. Tell me more. Her daughter, Marie Glapion, took over when the widow Paris got old. Most people thought it was this. The widow Paris died in 1881. After the death of the widow Paris, other voodoo queens surfaced. Tell me more about the Laveau tomb where one or both of the Maries are believed to be buried. It is a popular shrine. I myself to Really? No, but the cemetery is open to the... Tell me... You have... What are you... The killings in the newspaper? I know... It is the only city... Do you know anything? Ah, you have perhaps... They are beautiful creatures, do you not agree? I... You... I think I... What can you tell? It is one of the... What else? I am afraid I do not know the origins of... Do you have any idea what Cabri saint Gar means? I fear my... Tell me more about... You have... Have you ever heard of a Schottenjäger? No. Tell me. Me? Yes. What is... Why did you open a voodoo museum? The subject has fascinated me all my life. And what kind of background in voodoo do you have? Let us say that I cut my teeth on it, Mr. Knight. Do you do anything besides? No. The museum does not make me a rich man, but my material needs are simple. What are your own religion? My beliefs are too personal and too complex. Just... I am originally from the West Indies. Really? I was drawn... Just tell... I am a vegetarian. Really? That must be the hunter in you, Mr. Just... I do not... Just... I am not an easy person. Isn't that unusual for someone... Not at all. Actually, then, tell me, just, not everyone can come see the museum, so, I okay, anything coming, no, but then, you have me all to, just tell, I am a, re really, I, act, what exactly is hoodoo? Hoodoo refers to magic folk traditions of, hoodoo is a, bastard of voodoo. Many of the Grigri are similar, but hoodoo does not have the religious aspects of voodoo. Gabriel cannot the doorway Goodbye, Dr. John. Goodbye.
The marks are reddish in color and reminds Gabriel. An old man I want a copy of these strange marks. A marble Gabriel has Excuse me, sir. You got something to say, son? Mind if I pick your brain? Go ahead. These folks ain't it. Do you know anything about Marie Laveau? Sure, sure. She was the voodoo queen of New Orleans. A powerful voodooine and a powerful sorcerer. Believers still come to her tomb, you know. They write secret marks on the walls, leaving offerings and things. Then there's the tourists. They come out of curiosity. As a matter of fact, that big Dr. John fella from the voodoo museum. But Marie Laveau's tomb ain't the only one the believers visit and make markings and leave what else can you Her tombs on all of the tours. Even the... Of course, you may not know this, but some of the real serious voodoo types argue that she ain't in this one at all. It's all the same to me, I say. Save me a lot of cleanup work if she weren't here, if you ask me. What else can you... Boy, go out and buy a book. You said there were other marked tombs? <laughs> yep. I seen bull hearts left on tombs and a nest of vulture feathers, plates of peas and corn green, animal parts, human parts even it looked like. And this at one of the great family crypts, mind you. Odd how them type. No, 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 I ain't one for naming names. I don't like to encourage that kind of thing. It's distressing to the family. Don't tell me something. You know why the dead are buried in tombs and not in the ground, don't you? The water table's too high. Them coffins would float right out of their grave. <laughs> Them dead would go floating right down into the quarter. <laughs> Course if it were Mardi Gras, nobody'd even notice. What can you tell? They say it was part of an old religion. What? I don't really care. To what do you? Ain't it just awful, them finding those bodies with voodoo? I don't think there's any real voodoo going on. What do you- I told- What can you tell me about- Seem like everybody want to visit New Orleans at least once in their lives. And they love the cemetery tour. I see two- What can- There's lots of things to see. Do you know anything about snakes? Snakes? I see snakes around here all the time. Do you know? I don't mind. What? Why, St. John the Baptist is the patron saint. Sometimes we get some weird goings on in that cemetery on that night. More often a few nights before. People taking grave dirt, bones, and mold. That's... <laughs> yep. Don't know what they do with them, but it can't be pretty. Do you have any... No. Have you... I don't know what... Tell me. My name is Toussaint Gervais. What exactly? Oh, I keep the place tidy, cause. But a big part of my job, too, is looking out for the grievers, you know. People come to pay their respects, and they need looking out for. Sometimes they so grief-bound, they don't know what they're doing. Tell me about you. That's about all there is to say. The right 
family tomb. Several of Gabriel and Grant's family members are laid to rest. This is the last It's a piece of brick. This is the tomb of Marie. Odd looking marks. Food, trinkets and more unsettling things have food, trinkets and Welcome, Seeker. You must be the one Dr. John called me about. I guess so. My name is... Wait. Gabriel Knight? <laughs> You're too quick for me. Actually, Dr. John told me. You have come to the right place, Mr. Knight. Tell me how I can help. Could I ask you if... Of course. What can you tell me about voodoo? My practice is mainly selling charms and potions with magic. You know, everything from unrequited love to wandering spouses. But my spells and charms are powerful. And they work. What can you... Much of a voodoo... I make special protective grigri to be worn in secret. They keep... E what can you The recipes for voodoo charms have been What can you I have told What do you know? Why, that has not But I can tell you that you should stay as There is badness there. So you don't think the voodoo Fake? Let if I get information through the grapevine and make use of it, is that fake? No. That is part of a voodoo yen's power. If people don't believe, there is not much I can do. But if they do believe. But there are things, monsieur. Things not even a little bit fake, I can tell you. Believe it or not. What do you I work hard on fine-tuning my spiritual antenna, monsieur Knight. And I get a clear signal from that direction. Beware. What do you mean? I work hard on fine-tuning my spiritual antenna, monsieur Knight. And I get a clear signal from that direction. What can you tell me of New Orleans is the center of voodoo practice? What can It is a fascinating... What can... It is my fa... What can... It is my fa... Do you know... Snakes? You mean like my beloved Grimwald? She's a python, you know. Quite deadly, in the wrong hands. I was trained by one of the great voodoo queens to learn how to hypnotize and... Tell me. Oh, I wouldn't want to. What's the... St. John's Eve? There is always a traditional conclave on St. John's Eve. Most of our voodoo churches these days hold functions in the church hall. But in the old days, they had ceremonies out in the wild, and they wore animal masks and had a huge bonfire and dancing. I... Sometimes in the swamp, you know. Bayou St. John. What's the significance of Saint? Special ceremonies are prof. What's the significance? There is no night. What? There is. Do you have any idea what Cabris sunk? Do you know anything about? Oh yes, she was the first of the great voodoo queens. 
Do you know anything? She ruled Vu. Do you know anything? I'm sure a historian. Tell me about the animal masks. I saw them used once or twice when I was younger, but you don't see them much anymore. They are too close. Too close. Just bad karma. Tell me about. I don't know what else. Have you? I don't know. Tell me about you. Yes. How'd you get into this business? I trained in the voodoo arts for many years with the great Queen Tabitha. Really? You have never heard of her? <gasps> for shame! I I'm beginning to get that impression, yeah. What kind of people come to see you? Seekers after the truth, such as... Do you do anything else? I am a voodoo yen, and that is plenty. It takes much spiritual effort. How many voodoo yens are there? No one knows exactly. Many practice in secret. There are probably hundreds. But of course the level and the power of the voodoo yens differ greatly, depending on their training and natural gifts. Tell me any I haven't always lived in New Orleans. I came here from Kansas as... Tell me... I began studying voodoo more than 20 years ago. I am... Tell me anything... Many non-believers come to me. They... Tell me anything at all. Dr. John sends me many secrets. Tell me anything... I am happy here with my clientele and my snake. Tell me any. I haven't always lived... I can Very. Uh. What about her? Where'd you get Grimwald? She belonged to a traveling reptile show. She was being terribly mistreated, so I offered to buy her. She's named after a spirit guide I had once. The spirit Grimwald was a very powerful female snake priestess in Egyptian times. Grimwald doesn't sound Egyptian. I only know what the spirits tell me. How'd you learn to handle Grimwald? I told you, a great voodoo queen taught me. Ah. Oh. Would you consider giving me one? No, I couldn't do that. You might do some grigri of your own, no? One must be very careful with such things. Hey. Are you sure you wouldn't consider giving me? I told Are you sure you wouldn't consider giving me? I told How about showing me how you... Really? You would like to see me dead? That would be... Swell. I won't make you wait. No matter what you see, do not. I'll give it my best. She's a bit busy. There. Could I ask you a few? Sir. Oh. Uh, what about? Tell me. You have to be careful when handling a snake. Um, tell me. Many people are a toad. Tell me. Snakes shed their skins from time to time. You have. I'll keep it in. Tell me. Grimwald is very responsive to vibration. She doesn't recognize her name, but if I stomp. Tell me. You have to be careful when handling. Um, nothing. Oh. Give me an example of a gri gri. All right. Here's an old one. Take a lodestone and some brimstone to a crossroads at midnight. Light the brimstone with a match. And a spirit will come and give you advice in gambling. Give me an... Here's an old hoodoo Dr. Grigri. Place a dime under your client's tongue. And if the client is under a spell of any kind, the dime will turn black. 
Give me an To send someone away, take a rotten egg and write that person's name on it nine times. You can also write on it where you want to Give me Here's a nasty one. To kill someone, get a sock or a shoe that belongs to that person. Does that Right. Give me a To ensure the safety of your child, cut a lock of its hair while it is still a baby. These are interesting. They're very old. The grigri that I prepare is much more powerful, I can assure you. Give me an All right. Uh What about It is I shall use She's red. She's red. She's red. She's red. Gable grabs the shed snake skin while Magenta is otherwise occupied. They are truly in. That's certainly. Gabriel Look Do these symbols mean anything to you? Oh, the voodoo code. It is... Really? Great. Hmm. Well, some of it is nonsense, I'm afraid. Whoever wrote this wasn't very good. That's all right. Just tell me what is... It starts with a D and a J, and then... Okay, this part makes sense. It says, Conclave tonight, bring... Mm, then there's more nonsense. F, W, E. Well, that last bit might mean cash. Fresh cash? That's okay. D, J, Conclave. K. I'm happy I... Gabriel magnifies the shed skin from... The snake scales are hued brown. Those two are Gabriel is the man. The man. The man. Gabriel magnifies the scale from the lake. The iridescent scale is brilliantly hued with greens and purples. Gabriel can see. Well, I guess I'll be gone now. Peace and harmony. Right. Hello. Mm. Bonjour, Monsieur Walker. Oh, bienvenue, Madame Casino. Well, I'll tell you, Mr. Walker. I'm certain someone's buried a sleep knot bag somewhere near my step. Oh, don't that beat all. Well, you're gonna need some... Do you think that would help? I do hope you're right. I said three rosaries this morning for our lady's intervention. Rosaries are good, sure enough. But you burn those candles too and you're gonna whip any old no sleep... Very well, Mr. Walker. 
Oh, and there's another thing. I didn't catch her at it, but I know Mrs. Lefevre put stomachache powder in my tea at the last meeting of the Creole Grand. You put nine pinheads up in a little box, add a pinch of graveyard dust, and put it... That'll turn the trick back on Mrs. Lefevre, and she'll be the one with the bellyache. I have the pins. If the Blessed Virgin will grant... We, oui, madame. Though it don't hurt to be proactive, no... Naturellement. Mais non. Au revoir, monsieur. Mind if I ask you a few questions? I ask would you... Can you tell me what you know about voodoo? This is a novelty shop, monsieur. Do you think I'm stupid? These are novelties, curiosities. If people want to think they're magic, it's not my concern, you know. Are you telling me that you own a voodoo shop, but you know nothing about voodoo practices? Zafé n'est pas affaire blanc. What is that? Means you should mind your own business. What do you know, Monsieur? Look, I don't have your answers, B. Look, I don't. What can you? I've lived here. What can you? T I'm a busy man, Monsieur. What can? If you're not from around here, Monsieur. Do you know any? What kind of snakes? Um, the kind they use in vo pythons and boas. Really? Do you have one? Are you crazy? Do you know I've already... What's the significance of St. John's Eve? It's the biggest night of the year in voodoo. What goes on exactly? Uh... What's the sig... I've said... What did you mean when you said... I didn't say that. You did. You heard wrong, Miss... I did You did. Have you ever... Marie, she's somebody from the old days. One of those folk tales. Have you ever... I don't know much, monsieur. Do you know any... Like the ones in the voodoo rituals they do for the tour? Right. I used to sell a few. The only one left is Willie Jr. over there. The old crocodile. Can you tell me any... They're curiosities, no? Oh, yeah. Can you tell me? Oh. Have you? Man, I don't even know what. Tell me about yourself. My name's Willie Walker. Tell me about you. How did you get into? Why should I discuss my? Tell me about you. How did you? Why should I? That cus customer? The woman I saw in here. I don't talk about my customers to men who come in off the street. I can't tell you anything about it. It's I can't tell. About Willie Jr. Hmm, a hundred bucks. Me and Willie Jr. are very close, no. I could part with him for less. Would you take fifty? Don't insult. Would you take Don't. Hey, Grace. Here I am. Oh, joy. Got a minute, Grace? What's up? Do you know... Uh, I... I... Do you know... Wasn't she a... That's right. Well, you just heard her... Could you do some research for me? Sure. What? I need you to look up a Madame Cazenou. Madame Cazenou? Is she related to the murders the same way you're f- Grace. Cazenou. As if that makes a difference to you. Anything else? I can't think of any- 
Okay. Do you have message? Nope. Tell me about. What else? Just tell me. I just got my master's in history in class. Nothing. Suit yourself. It's time to close shop. So it is. Have a nice night. You too. See you tomorrow. Mm. I also checked out Kazanu. There are multiple listings in the white pages. I got the page, but you'll have to figure out the right one. Great, thanks. Now, are you going to tell me what happened yesterday with Mel? Mm. Don't tell me you act- Ah, uh, the star- Gabriel. You don't seriously think she's interested. She you underestimate the Nyatt family's tragic poet Samuel. When Daddy married Mom, she was the hottest cat- Hmm. Huh. I always suspected there was something fishy in your family tree. But seriously, I think you should be careful. Wow, Grace. I'm serious. I it's called jealousy, my dear. And you're right. You should be jealous of Malia Getty. I just- I Oh, never mind. I'll just fix it. The point is to Times Pico Hune. Under the cultural events section, there's a note Gabriel's horoscope for the day. I know. Got a minute, Grace? What's up? Do you have messages for me? Your pal mostly called. He left a message that they're interrogating a sus- Sounds- Mm-hmm. Do you have more- That man from Germany called again, Wolfgang Ritter. Now- I took down his number. If you change your mind and want to give him a call- Can I get that phone? Sure. I'll give it to you when we're done talking. Do you have more- I've given every- Here's that phone number. Thanks. Hey, kid. Uh, Gabe Pet. How much would you give me for it, Bruno? Gabriel, don't you... Stay out of it. Ooh! Yeah, I'll let you have it, all right. Hmm, well, I could give you a hundred. That's all I can let go at the moment, you know. Gabriel... Grace, let me...
Fine. Gabriel! Here! You better take good care of... Really? Well, I fully intend to make the most of its display, though not for your sake, I'm sure. I can't. I don't... It, it's just a pain... Gabriel's bedroom. The medicine. I'll take this hair gel. This is the last. Somewhere. Somewhere there's a New Orleans phone book missing one. Somewhere there's a new eye. The number written. There's nothing there to operate. Hello? I'm calling from the Dixieland Drug Store. Castro, be quiet. I'm a friend of the own. I'm sure I don't know what you're talking. Cajun Critters Animal Clinic, this is... Do you know anything about... Our doctors see just about any type of animals. Okay. There's nothing... Gabriel never has figured out... Cajun Critters Animal Clinic, this... Do you have... Madame Cosano? Sure, I know her. Really? Hmm... She told me she... Um... Uh... I'm worried about Castro. Castro? Well, I guess if you know Castro, it's okay. Thanks. Guten Tag. Sie haben Schloss Ritter erreicht? I'm looking for Wolf. Ja, einen Moment. Ja, ist es Gabriel? This is Gabriel Knight. I have been having premonitions of great danger for you, Gabriel. You... What the hell? It is hard to explain on the phone. I have had senses... Uh, feelings about you. It took me a long time to have you tracked down. I had a sense that Heinz had a grandson, but... Until this dream started, I, I did not know if I... You say you're... A yes. Heinz was my brother. There is much about... Come to Schloss Ritter in Rittersberg, West Germany. It is our family home. I will tell you everything when you come. You must come immediately. You are in great danger there. Look, I appreciate the family spirit and all, but frankly I don't know you from Adam, and I'm not going to fly off to Germany, even if I could of Gabriel, please. If you won't listen, at least let me send you something. Well... Please, Gabriel, you are the last of our line. I am too old. All right. Good. Gabriel can I'm going out. Have fun. 